I'm really hungry to defend my title and that's that was my my first goal to win the tournament so um, I put myself in the position to to give it the best shot there is you know being in the final so I'm really looking forward to it. Beginning of the match, I was I was nervous because you know uh, I was happy I came back to the semis again. But for some reason, I really want to win the match. But I don't know what happened today. Just come to the court, feeling like okay, just do it. I think it was just a combination of you know the way she was playing. Like I said, she was. She was aggressive, she was taking the first ball and doing something with it, and I, and when I was trying to, I was making too many, you know, unforced errors. Last time, 2011 is the first time to the Grand Slam final, so I was a little bit shocked because I didn't know what I should do. And also, no one told me what I, what I, what I should do on the court, so. But this time I got more experience, so I think it should be better. Um, I just, I did my best. I obviously didn't get the win, but I just did everything I could and it came up a little bit short, but all in all, it was, it was okay. No, not at all. I mean, she played obviously a really good match. First set, she played awesome. Um, got close in the second. I just, I didn't want to give it to her, basically. I just kind of worked for every point and it didn't go my way, but I wouldn't say at all that her, what happened affected the match. That's, I think, the misunderstanding of the situation. You know, that what I said, that I was stressed out and choked, is not because of I couldn't re you know, finish my shot. It was just so stressing me out, the pain that I had, that, you know, uh, maybe it was overreaction, but I just, I just really, really couldn't breathe. Like, if it was one of my friends, I would be like, oh my God, that sounds like a PP, which is a personal problem. But other than that, <laughs> it's just, I mean, unfortunate. It's tennis, you know, you, you lose a match and you go on to the next one. I've been in this position before, I've come through it. I'm, I'm tough, I'm not afraid to go out and, and keep working and work as hard as I can to be quicker, better, um, you know, improve in these situations. And, and when I do have another chance, take it.